Good morning, friend. This is Alexander from Shaska Tech. Uh, this item on the floor is our JT6800 model. This model, yeah, as you can see, is medium size and weight. Now it's in my hands, the same item you have purchased in our company. And about the power cord, this is waterproof power cord. We can connect it and screw the protection firmly. So the total pump can be suitable in submersible installation. Yeah. Uh, we can see the label on the pump. The input voltage it can range can be from 6 to 24 watts. The max sturdy lift is about 80 centimeters to 800 centimeters. Uh, about the, the flow rate uh, can be ranging from 450 to you know 1100 liters per hour. Yeah, this pump was intended for use in water and uh, about the polarity the brown is positive the blue is negative so dc power connection uh, here we have to note that uh, the lift this max sturdy lift or head this concept is quite different from the spring height of the pump they are quite different the lift value means that when pump works at certain power voltage, you know, such as 24 watts, yeah. Then, when users connect the outlet with the matching external tube or hose, uh, the lift value means that the max height of water flow, this water flow can reach inside this tube or hose. Please know, it's not the spring height. They are very different from each other. Yeah. Uh, as we can see, the working voltage range is wide from 6 to 24. So we can check its performance when we connect this power supply. This is uh, this power supply. Yeah. It's a power AC DC converter. And the output voltage can be, can be easily adjusted. Yeah. So we can show you the performance of course i have to say that uh, this pump will absolutely has the lift value of over 10 centimeters so i guess you have mis under mistake the, the concepts yeah so i will show you the performance first of all as i can i have just mentioned this pump supports some much more installation so and the four removable suckers yeah suckers so we here we just uh, throw this pump into the water okay as you can see because of the suckers the pump can be easily clean to the surface of the bucket right now it's under water so we we will try to connect the power supply with the pump and check its performance okay you know this is red red positive black negative now the voltage is 7.7 .7. the current becomes 0 0.36 and we can check its, its performance now uh, it, it's a small flow, right? So we gradually increase or escalate the, the power output. Now, okay. Now, when we adjust the voltage to around 12 volts, we can see the flow, the spring. Note that. Uh, here we show you the spring height, not the lift value. Uh, because uh, now I, I don't have the tube at hand, so uh, I can show you, just show you the, the general performance, okay? So, as we have just mentioned, 
this pump can normally work at 24 watts. So we just directly adjust the pump input voltage to 24 watts. Okay, now the current becomes 1.26. It means that the power consumption of this pump of this pump is about uh, 20 maybe 28 watts yeah now we can see its performance as you can see this is the spring spring effect of course the uh, spring is much lower than the height the real height when we connect the pump with with some tube now at hands I, I just have a uh, one meters long the tube yeah so I just uh, show you generally show you because the, the the tube is not enough okay you can see this is the height of one meter one meter of height yeah so uh when you want to exactly uh get the real lift height of the pump you can connect it with a matching tube maybe uh such as this pump uh is labeled value uh, lift value is eight meters you can connect it with uh four to five meters to check whether uh, at five meters height there is still flow out it means that the flow can go still go higher yeah uh, in real circulation applications uh, it's the real meaning of this concept and uh, the real performance of this pump yeah of course it is absolutely over just 10 centimeters of course if you just uh, power this pump with a uh, very low voltage such as just the six seven watts of course the, the the power of the pump is very low and the flow will be very low the higher the voltage the higher the power and the higher the flow so I guess my video can give you some maybe intuitive view about this pump performance uh, of course if you have any further problem or requirement uh, you can contact us or leave us message we will timely reply yeah no problem so thank you for your time bye bye